This video is for anyone looking for a roughly $400,000 home in Santan Valley. This is just under 2,000 square foot. It's a three bedroom with a den. It's two and a half bath, two car garage. Beautiful home, move in ready. It's got upgrades already included in the price. The price is fixed. Hello, let me take you through this house here. I'm gonna show you the whole thing. I wanna bring your attention to the blue tape all over this house. They've got a really amazing construction superintendent. He leaves no stone unturned. The painters probably hate him. And there's the potential den, living area, study. That's the primary bedroom back there. Here's the main living room, the kitchen, and the dining area. It's a move-in ready, so it's already loaded with some upgrades. You got the granite countertops, You've got the hard tile flooring, the wood plank hard tile flooring, and there's a nice recessed covered patio. We're gonna go into that backyard in a minute and overlook that view fence. There's the big granite island with a single sink. There's the whirlpool microwave, the gas grill top oven and stove. Here's a fair-sized walk-in pantry. And I want you to notice the tiled backsplash here. You don't have that on a lot of move-in readies. And they've got some very nice appliances. They've got nice options. There's that sink again. That's an upgrade in some homes. Now we're going to turn around. Another thing I want you to see, we'll make another pass through the kitchen here. I like to give you a lot of good views. Run down through here. That window down there is a single pane. It's a non-opening window, but I really like it. It's a beautiful view. There's the view fence, and let me show you what I'm talking about on this view fence. Sometimes the view fence is a drawback. If it's overlooking a like a wasteland or a browned out golf course, or if it has a six foot wide walking path going along it, then you got people gawking into your backyard. This has none of that. This is actually a, a beneficial view fence because you got a nice view to this open area. See that park wraps around to the end of the street here to the house next door. You'll see when we look at the front again. So no, no real views to any backyard homes there. Even these two homes side by side are more than five feet apart, you know, from the property lines. Sometimes you only have 10 feet there, five and five. That recessed patio, all the glasses in out of the sunlight. Run back through the house here. Again, wood plank, hard tile flooring, granite countertops, tile backsplash, upgraded appliances included. That's the thing of an upgrade. You don't have to add 10 or 15 or 20 percent towards the purchase price to pay for all these upgrades. There's a nice little closet right outside the primary bedroom. Jackets and boots and shoes. Here's the primary bedroom. And this has a Pretty nice primary bath. There's that view to the back. You can see no houses for a good distance back there. This is a prime location, a prime lot. Now look at the distance between the, the sinks and that vanity there. And there's your shower. There's your dual sinks. A lot of counter space there. Also, they've got uh, they got a lot of space in these, uh, that linen closet too. They've got both, uh, they've got two medicine cabinets, one on each end for all your stuff. Uh, a lot of the builders quit putting medicine cabinets in at all. There's a pretty uh, ample size walk-in closet. See the blue tape? This construction superintendent's a maniac. I, I don't even, I can't even imagine everything he's marking, but everything where you see blue tape is something he wants fixed. This is the difference between a house that's uh, ready to go when you move in and a house that has maybe stuff unfinished, maybe uh, six weeks after you're in, you still can't get things fixed. You're not gonna have that here. The walkthrough with these guys is not to put blue tape on the wall. The walkthrough is to show you here's the house. It's ready to go. 
here it is. We're gonna run down and see the other bedrooms. Here's a here's a excellent little uh, called a powder room. Just a toilet. It's just right off the main living room there. So when you got company over, you don't gotta send them traipsing through the master, you know, the primary bedroom to use the you know use the bathroom. You can just send them right there. There's your and that here's your laundry room with some nice whirlpool washer and dryer included uh, what we just spun through there was the the den the study the extra living space here's bedrooms two and three little peek in there vertical sliding windows are always a plus you don't get that dust on the track wheels little bathroom there so that's bathroom two, bedroom two and three. And the only place you have carpet is in the, the bedrooms here. Now look at that view to the street. Look, no neighbors directly across. You could have 20 cars parked up and down that street and not blocking any driveways. And then we jump back out front here. Look up and down the street. To the left is that park from the backyard wraps around to over there. Beautiful HOA wall over there. And that's all. If this kind of content helps you out, give us a like and subscribe. But also, if you want to go out and see any of these homes, any city, any town, any price range, reach out to me. I'm here for you. Um, I can help you out any way you want, any way you need. Let's get you going.